Sports are so excited to bring it to you. Along with Ray Ferraro, my name is James Sabalski. Let's get down in the corner. That's a good save. Maintains possession. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Here's a shot! Scores! He drops into the butterfly to try and take away as much of the net as he can. But the shooter's got enough time to find some room. He sees it, and he doesn't miss. Realm has got the game's first goal here, Razor. Well, you got the one-goal lead now, but you want to extend. Pori's got it along the wall. Hangs onto the puck. Moves inside! Oh, what a birthday present that is as he scores! I guess in the great context, it doesn't really matter, but it does feel great to score on your birthday. That's a good shot. He zips it by the goaltender, but he works himself into a clean area on the ice to shoot this from the high slot. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. That's on the stick. From his own end, he picks up the puck. Carries it across the line. Almost lost the puck. Scores! And they go up by one! Tied no more. That's a big goal to be able to take the lead. Now coaches talk about getting to the front of the net, make it difficult on the goalie, take his eyes away. Man, he only can see the player's butts in front of him. He can't even see the puck. Realm has taken the lead. Ray, do you like their game tonight? I do. I like lots of it. I mean, there's been times where they've lost their way. Puck against the boards. Asat's got it behind the net. Slides the puck down low. And that's off a stick. Scores! Well, you just keep working away. Your lines roll over and over and over. You hope to build a little momentum. One shot ties the game. And now it's a whole new ball game. And we are all evened up here. A quick flick of the wrist, and that snapshot beats the goaltender. He's in the low slot. He doesn't have much time to think about it. Horry's even things up here in the late stages of this second period. Work gets control of it once again. Realm has got the puck along the boards. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Scores! And the deadlock is broken! Well, what a crushing goal to give up. But the other guys worked hard for it. They pressed the play, and now they've got the lead. Man, it looks like a bus depot in front of the net. You know it's a tough one when you can't see the goalie. That means he can't see the puck. the third. Like lots about the way that they played this for the centerman tied him up. Pospisil's taking it from his own end. A, sh a chance to ice it into the empty net. He scores into the empty net and that's all she wrote. Uh, you can see the one team is going to be able to relax a little bit now as they pad the lead. Should be enough to wrap this thing up. The empty net goal should seal it. Lucos 
Bruins added to their lead with the empty netter, and Ray, that's pretty much all she wrote, I would say. Well, you grind away to get the lead through this much of the game, and they pull the goalie, they're gonna pressure you. You put it away with an easy one into the empty net. It is all over! Ray, when you look at the initial score of this one, it'll look like a decisive victory, but this really wasn't the case until the end. Now, once they give up the empty net goal, it becomes a two-goal spread. This thing is over. Man, I hated being on the ice for empty net goals against. They stink for your plus-minus. For my broadcast partner, Ray Ferraro, my name is James Sabalski. Thanks so much for joining us. Good night.